So you never had a Howlin' Bucks? The Howlin' Bucks, we have Carolina Reaper, Ooh. Sauce Pepper in the world, Trinidad, Ooh. Scorpion, uh, oh. Ghost Pepper. Hey, put me in the mouth! Hey, Trev, my lip burned really bad, Trev. Like, really bad, bro. I don't care. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, nigga, you about to go to bed. Shut up. Man, you already know, we hungry. We starting this at the office, man. They upped the budget on us. You know what I'm saying? The show's been doing good. Now, Josh getting us a black truck so we can go do our shit now. We ain't got to waste our own gas. You know what I'm saying? So let's go. Budget on us, we get the black truck now. Where's the chauffeur? Thank you, Duno. You're welcome. Thank you. Let's go. Sing it again. All right, ready? Country take me on to a place I belong. West Virginia, Mount and Mama. I don't know the rest, but it's a great song. Hit a nigga in his face. Today is gonna be. This might go hands down as my favorite We Hungry episode today. Why? Because you're an investor in both of these places? I'm definitely not an investor in both these places. That is not a fun fact. I'm going to say this. This is a bold statement. I think Howlin' Ray's is the best hot chicken in Los Angeles, hands down. I don't see nothing else. Who paved the way for Howlin' Ray's? Howlin' Ray's. Dave's Chicken. No, Dave's came afterwards. No. Dave's Hot Chicken came afterwards. And Dave's Hot Chicken, don't get me wrong, is amazing. Y'all make sure y'all go taste Dave's Hot Chicken. You get the sliders with the cheese and the honey. The fries is, is amazing. I'm just talking about the taste of chicken. Howlin' Ray's has one location so far that the wait hour is two to three hours every single day. Out here in the West Coast. Out here on the West. No, 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 no. They have multiple, but around. No, oh. the, no. The, for they have a Howlin' Ray's by San Diego. Wait, 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 wait. No, niggas, only two. I know. Where's the other location? What city is it on? Nigga, it's one in LA and the one we going to now, the Grand Open. Wait, where's the one in LA? The it's an um it's like downtownish. Damn. Yeah, so you was off. Highland like Rays could easily franchise. They don't want to franchise. That's what I'm saying. They're a little more like, you know, a little more secluded. That's why they're still a little more low key. They're not low key, they're bro. If you ask anybody in LA, if you ask everybody in LA, they know what Howlin' Rays is, bro. Everybody knows what Howlin' Rays is. Okay. People have been talking about okay, it, bro. Okay. It's not a two or three hour wait for the line every day okay. for years at a time. Okay. Bro. So we call three people on 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 for each of our phone and be like oh, and be like, what yeah. are you? Okay, who do you know? Hey, hey, bro, you know what Howlin' Rays is? Do it. All right, I'll go first. Go ahead. Hey, fuck it, Rams. I'm on the phone. Hey, Rams, do you know what Howlin' Rays is? I mean, Howlin' Rays is? Wait, what? Holland Ray, do you know what that is? Nah. Okay, do you know what Dave's chicken is? He's only 22, fool. Dave's hot chicken? Yeah, yeah, okay. Do you know what Dave's hot chicken is? Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. I'll call you right back. Okay. So that's one. Easy. Okay. <laughs> you can't call the owner of Holland Ray. <laughs> And I'm not knocking either establishment. They're both great establishments. <laughs> but let's just... This ain't the owner of Howlin' Ray's. That's the owner of Josh. Crippo. Hey, D. Crippo. Yes, sir. Hey, what's the best What's the best uh, hot chicken place in Los Angeles? Howlin' Ray's. Bro, it's not even close. Nah, he said that like... Oh, I'm like, going back. Nah, get the fuck out. That was... That was what strange. do you mean? Who was that? I just asked a real question. Who was it? That's the homie. <laughs> Who was it? Was it S Dot? That's the homie. It was S Dot. S Dot's the one that plugged us. Get the fuck out, bro. No. Hey, I'm gonna let I'm gonna let my guy speak for himself. But we going to the grand opening of their Pasadena location right now. You know what I'm saying? Black truck. Man. What's next? Company cars? I love it, man. We gotta keep this going. If we get a truck done that says we hungry with just our faces all over it. And and Josh and Travis, obviously. We'll put their faces like in the trunk or something. Yeah, we ain't never gonna get paid. We finally here over at Holland Ray's Pasadena location. Shout out to S Dot, man. My guy lining stuff up once again. We're on a quest today, man. The quest is we're gonna see if we can make Duno a believer. Is this the best hot chicken in Los Angeles, or is it possibly the best hot chicken in the world? Yeah, Duno, 
Are you excited? Yes. And the theory we have on no jumper right now, ongoing bed, is that AD is a partner at Hollywood. No, I'm not. But I, I hope to be so. <laughs> but I'm going to ask the owner one thing, though. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to tell y'all. that My homeboy, shout out to Bad Luck, because I know he's going to see this. He has like a debit card that they gave him that he can come to Howlin' Rays whenever he wants to. So basically a free night. pass. Well, I don't know the pool free, but he gets in front of the fucking line. I mean, but if you're going to let me go in front of the line, you might as well give me the food for free as well. No, but that's a flex, though. It's a three-hour line. It used to be like this. Excuse me, sir. You can't come in here. You were like, I have my card. And <laughs> you just walk by everybody, just... Ray gave it just, to me. Just slowly walking like this, look. Yeah, just back up. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm standing by it. Do know we're going to try to make him a believer today. The quest today is to convince my fat ass that this is better than the competitor. And convince the owner to give us a credit card. Yeah, fact. How you doing, my brother? I'm doing good, man. How you guys doing? Man, man, real good. How much stuff is on the menu? Overall, we got about say but we got about five, six items on the menu. Okay, five, so can six. we get like two or three of everything? We need like two, three, four, five, six, seven of everything. I can do that. We hungry, my brother. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, Me and Steve kind of look alike. Yeah. Y'all do look alike. You should be with us, man. What are you doing here? Hey, do no do no number one, do no number two. Why the fuck am I number two to my own name? <laughs> He's a better clone. Look at him. Oh, hey. he's just taller. He's taller. All right, so I gotta, I gotta ask, how high you guys wanna do everything? <laughs> how high you looking to go? Because I, I can do, I can do order. I could, I'm gonna do a little bit of everything. I could do one order of tenders howling. That's the hottest one we got on the main. I'm, I ain't gonna lie, I'm scared, man. Bro, that's crazy. That's gonna fuck up my day, dog. If I eat that shit, <laughs> you do it for that. I'll do it if you guys do it. Nah, that shit is hot, fool. I'll do it with you. All right, we all three got to do it. Yeah, all right. Uh, at least a bite, Duno. I'll buy it. Yeah, just bite. a bite, just a bite. That's all one you got to do. With no, like, like with no Dalton Islands? Nah, no sauce. No. Nah, we got to do the sauce, dog. No, nah, we got to do it no sauce, no Duno. Sauce. Oh, my God. Here we go, man. Duno, putting the sauce on. For the love of content, I'm, I'm dreading this. Oh, yeah. something a little, something a little light for you guys. Okay, can we, right. can we separate the super spicy ones? I'm gonna let you know it's all marked and ready for you guys, okay. just so you know what you're getting into. So Medium sandwich right here, medium in half, so you guys should share. Okay. I got some of our matte fries, we loaded fries with some collard greens, a little hot sauce, a little comeback sauce on there. We got the tenders, country, mild, and medium. Okay. All right, we got a mild leg and a hot breast. Okay. And then we start to kick it up a little bit right here. We're gonna have the medium wing, hot wing, howling wing. My guy Steve's gonna come back with some gloves for you guys. Okay. The last thing okay. you wanna do is you know, I don't get want you guys to touching nothing after, okay? okay exactly. Okay. So we got some mild, more mild wings, we got country legs, we got our Mario fries, loaded fries right there, Mario. cheese fries with uh, some chicken chopped up, we got slaw pickles and comeback sauce. And I got some pickles, extra sauce, and some macaroni salad to help round. And then can we go. get some forks? Some forks? Well. I thought you guys were just gonna go just straight uh, up with the hands. We no? need forks and gloves uh, you, and all that. We're, we're not savages. Just a little bit. You know what, Duno? Let's just go crazy. We'll try this plate first, all right? This is the chicken sandwich. I'm a no pickles type of guy. Toast. Good luck, bro, because this is, this is about to be bad. Not this white book, god damn it. Come on, Duno. That's good. The spice level, it's like a one. Just a little kick. I like mine's a little more hotter. I know we're going to keep going up. So that's coleslaw, you feel me? Good mixed up coleslaw with some mayonnaise. I don't do pickles. I know. Hot chicken is the, is the thing right here, but I'm one of the ones that just, you know, check out the pickles. Mm. It is a little messy. I wish we had an extra plate, but overall, seven out of ten is gas. So okay. I fuck with it. Uh, let's try the fries. Toast, nigga. Toast. That's different. No, this is really good. I never thought I would like collard greens on fries. One of the most important things in a restaurant is that everything could be good, but then their fries taste like... Number 12. Exam example, in and out they make everything good, but they're fucking fried. It tastes like cardboard and it's fucking stiff and hard. No, no. in and out fries is good when they're hot. When they cold, uh, forget about it. They, they're still pretty hard. We're, we're, we're being honest here. We hungry. No, you got to be honest. I mean, me personally, I get animal style when I'm Me too, me too. But what I'm saying is like, these fries alone, they probably taste really good. Damn. I'm going to put these fries next to McDonald's fries. I'm going to give this a... a 8 out of 10. No, I don't know. I might give it a 9. This is a 9. This is a 9. The collard greens is crazy with it. This is this is, this is is a winner right here. This is better than this. Right now, I agree. All right, let's move on. These are the tenders. Okay, so that's not spicy. 
Mild. Mild. Hot. Hot. Let's start with this one. You want to start with the hot one? Yeah, fuck it. Let's go. Hey, without sauce, this tastes of chicken. God damn it, Duno. Well, motherfucker, you dropped the nominee. <laughs> All right, toast. It's going to get worse. 10 out of 10, bro. 10 out of 10. Just the chicken, bro, is crazy. Okay, I ain't gonna lie, I was expecting it for it to be hotter. But it's good, the chicken is good. Chicken is well cooked, let me, let me finish. Chicken is well cooked. I expected it to be a little hotter, but it's well cooked, it's well cooked. What, what would you rate it, Joe Duno? Um, that is, that's a, just, that's a good piece of chicken. That's a 10 out of 10 right there. And this is the mild. This is the mild, let's go. Oh. There we go. Come on, Duno. So far, what are you thinking about Halo Rays, man? Keep it G. It's guys, it's guys. Good country. Is it above everything so far? Keep it real. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like the bread. Okay. Minus the bread. What do you think about the chicken? They're winning. They're winning. But we got more. Yeah. Best piece of chicken in Los Angeles. I stand by it. I didn't even get a pickle with it. Hold on. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, it's good. It's really good. The crunches you feel when you bite into it, that shit don't get stuck in between your teeth because it's good, you know what I mean? And I got gaps. Like if I'm about consistency, and, and so far they haven't failed in any of them, I'm not saying they're all my favorite, but... I think we, all, I think we almost there. I think we almost there. See, the dude, dude going in for seconds and yeah. thirds. Obviously, if you're eating, you get a good side with it. Let me taste something back on salad. Ooh. All right, let's try the Mario fries, Duno. See some chicken pieces in there. Get a good little piece of chicken. Get that for the cam. I've always been a fan of like fries with chicken and shit like this. I'm a big fan. A toast, my brother. Oh. Sorry about that, brother. The only reason I don't like it is it's a little too loaded, too many pickles. I'm pretty sure you guys put out pickles, but you know, people need to be more careful with pickle loading and. Too much of the thing, it could kind of melt the, the fries down if you put too much, but it's all right. Collard greens. Need a little hot sauce, but it's busting. Yeah, no, mm -hmm. like Biggest fan, right? This is E Fans. Oh, for real? From Florida. Florida bro. How you doing? Oh, man, how you doing? Yes, sir. Be watching like the Mac Eats and all that stuff. Yo, man, so, yeah, hey, I got y'all to make sure though, right? Oh, here, I see. Man. Support oh, I your see, homies, man. man. How you doing? You guys good? I want the golden ticket, the man. The golden ticket. Got, that's what I'm here for. <laughs> I want my card. Fuck, how many people y'all know that have the golden ticket? Golden ticket. Yeah. Ain't I a lot of by, I don't, it ain't a lot of people got. I say about three. Three? It's only three. Yeah, about three. About three. Big time. My guy sticks. My guy bad luck. Bad yeah. luck. Yeah, yeah. I saw that. Yeah. The yeah. next yeah. need to be me. Let <laughs> <laughs> that shit drop right now. Let's see what's up. My guy. Thank yeah. you, bro. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, you guys enjoy it. Appreciate you, Jit. Okay, look, look. Let's move on to this one then, cause this looks like it's not, it's not gonna kill us. Hold up, dog. You don't even know which one is which. We're gonna get fucked. Dude. That's the Howling. That's Howling. This is Howling. I think. This one's a Howling. This is the only one that's howling. Told okay. you. So this is medium, medium plus, that's hot, and then that's mild. Okay. Got it. Okay. <laughs> you gotta be safe. If you need help, let me know. I got uh -huh. okay, okay, okay. Thank you, Duno number one. Hey, thank you. Thank what you. the fuck? All right, Duno. This is the hot. Josh gotta get a piece of the hot, too. Nigga. Hot chicken toast. Look at the shit Josh got, nigga. <laughs> It's too dry. I'm still going to tenders. It's too dry, huh? It's dry, right? It's kicking. It's definitely kicking in. <laughs> Starting to linger. I hope the water is right. I put my milk on this thing. If you guys don't know, fun fact, I have tongue surgery. So that shit kind of, that shit burning the fuck out of my tongue, bro. Bad. It's hitting you right now, huh? It's dry, though. That's the spice level I kind of prefer, though. But <laughs> it's not going anywhere. It's not going nowhere. <laughs> but okay, you might as well just go for the hot one, right? Yeah. This shit's lingering. We gotta do it. At least a bite. What's up, bro? You wanna do the Holland with us? I've done it before. No, but you wanna try the Holland Plus one? Holland Plus. <laughs> you down? I'm down. Oh, come on, sit down. Sit down too. We got four. We got four. What's your name, bro? Uh, Paul. You call me PJ though. PJ. Oh, okay, yeah. PJ. Yeah. All right, man. Yeah. So you never had a Howlin' Plus? Never had a Howlin' Plus. Ooh! Exactly. We're doing a, we're doing a, we're doing a nugget. Right, come on, fuck it, fuck right, come on, come on, come on, PJ. Yeah. Get one. Ah, oh, dog, this is trash. Wait, I want to smell it, hold on. No, don't do it. 
Oh my god! <laughs> we putting this in our body? Oh right. my god. Fuck it. No! Oh! <laughs> Cheers. Okay, Paul. Oh. Uh, <laughs> right, I'm right, not doing that, bro. I got him. <laughs> we got him, bitch. Oh. That's not good, dog. I Trev, my lip burnt really bad, Trev. Like, really bad, bro. Hey, give me the milk, man. Hey, give me the milk. Hey, bro, bro I need some. I need some ice for my lip. Do no, give me the fucking milk. Nah, I tried my lips burn bad way, like it's trembling too. Like I'm trying to stay calm. My See, lips. You ever try it again? No. <laughs> Not getting better, Bill. Oh, fuck her. Uh, I fucked up my whole appetite for her today. Look, you guys look good. You're, you're smiling and happy. Uh, and yeah, happy. I mean, I mean, yeah, man. You know us, we chef. Introduce yourself. I'm, I'm, <laughs> chef, I'm fucked up, up, man. I got you. Uh, how you doing? I'm Johnny. Um, one of the owners with uh, my wife Amanda Chapman what of uh, Hound and Ray's. Um, really, really excited to have you guys out here. It was super fun. Oh yeah, uh, man. We had fun to the fucking end. I, I, okay, do know <laughs> what, what is the verdict on Hound and Ray's? Hound and Ray's beat me over, man. Is it? What is it? The best chicken in Los Angeles. I and I can stand by that because I ain't gonna lie. Look, you fucked me up with this. I, like, I don't even want to touch nothing because I'm scared to fucking. Yeah, that, the, the fries, the fries with the collard green, I gotta give you. This is oh, yeah, probably yeah, one of the best yeah. things I've oh, tried yeah, in a long time. Yeah. And and um, chicken was very, very good. Juicy and crispy, which was good. But the fries, the fries with the collard green, and then the, what was the second thing we had? The tenders? The tenders, yeah. the tenders beat me over 100%. The hot tenders is probably the best the, thing I've had in a long Like when it comes to the, the best, the best, chicken? maybe the best in the world. I appreciate that. Yeah, big part of like, uh, so I've been a chef for like 13, 14 years. Wow. I used to work for Gordon Ramsay three years, Thomas wow. Keller for three years. You know Ramsey on the shows Come and all on. that. Yeah. Sure, sure. So my background's like in fine dining. Um, okay. And so a big thing they teach you in fine dining is ingredients are very important. So we, we do spend a little bit more on our product in terms of the chicken and the, the, our bread and our pickles and all that stuff. And hopefully that kind of like shines through. Um, and, and it does take us a little bit longer in terms of like yeah, the process fact. and stuff. Yeah. But it's because we come from like that fine dining background. Yeah, you know? But you know what's funny? So the, the, the fries, both of the fries, there's a Mario fry and a Matt fry. Yeah. I had some like day one guys that have been with me for a long time and they would eat this after lunch and they're like, chef, can we put it on the menu? And I was like, bet, let's do it. So Matt is one of our employees and that's what he would eat after lunch. Wow, see, but see, shout out you. But it's legacy. A, yeah, shout out you being a dope um, co-owner, chef, that you allow your, you feel me? You allow feedback from your workers, which is always a good thing. A lot of people don't allow that. But these fries right here, top tier, bro. Let you. me let me ask you this because, um. We were talking in the car. Uh, why doesn't Howland Rays want to franchise even more? I'm pretty sure you guys get offers year round. Yeah. So what's the what's 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 the story behind Howland Rays? And you know why don't you guys want to franchise more? And man, not necessarily not franchise. Yeah. But why you guys you know 
give me the business model. No, I got you on that. So for me, um, so a lot of the offers of like a lot of other hot chicken places that are franchising and stuff, they were approaching us for about three years, right? And for me, I opened up this restaurant uh, when I found my father dead on the floor mm. and I was like, you know what? Uh, his name was Ray Zone. I said, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna open a hot chicken restaurant in LA call me crazy it's never you know no one's been serving hot chicken in LA yeah. um, and no one even knew what it was we started with the quarters and so half of the name from Howlin uh, Ray's is, is a tribute to my father right wow. and so wow. I, I, yeah I, I, I just risked everything I maxed out my credit cards I took out an unsecured car loan on my wife's Fiat at the time and I uh, opened a truck basically and so um, we had a lot of offers after the first year, second year, when they when we, they see we're popping and it's really busy. But for me, it's always been a family thing. You know, um, I'm not necessarily trying to get rich. I'm not trying to just like, you know, I don't know, over uh, exploit and decent. I mean, how many Mexican spots you go to and it's watered down? You know, or, or even other other different um, types tacos. of Tacos, yeah, tacos. Exactly. We were just having that conversation where it's one of those things where like, LA so big because because we're arguing kind of about best restaurant and I'm like it's kind of hard to choose because you can't even name yeah, like the like best taco ever yeah. you you can never name a better taco than another taco because there's so fucking many you yeah. know what I mean but that's that's why I stayed in LA and that's why I fuck with LA so much is because originally I was gonna go to South uh, and cook out there in Nashville. Yeah. Um, but I, I, I love L.A., man, because it's like you can go get the best tacos in the world, Korean barbecue, sushi. You can go get, like, whatever you need, you know what I mean? And we, we got it, you know? Yeah, but we're a big-ass melting pot when it comes to food. Exactly. Like, in my high school, there was 3,000 kids, oh, yeah. and there was, like, four or five white kids, and, it was, and I was one of them. And I love that. I love that upbringing, you know, yeah, that yeah. mix of so many different cultures. Oh. Um, and to me, that's that's so L.A., but, you know what I mean? Yeah, just to come you're here, experience this, even hearing the story more, y'all got to come mess with it, man. Family business, I understand completely. This is the creme de la creme of chicken. And, so when and, and wait a minute, that Howlin' Plus, that wasn't cool, man. That, wasn't cool. that was fun. Where is it? It's fun. I mean, you tried it, right? You know. And he oh, ate, dog. our guy PJ over there, he had two, he, two oh, nuggets. Yeah, Johnny, can you please tell us what is in the... Howlin' sauce, the last one, the Howlin Plus. Howlin Plus. So uh, in the Howlin' and the Howlin' Plus, we have Carolina Reaper. We have a little bit, which is the hottest pepper in the world. Trinidad Scorpion. Uh, we have uh, Ghost Pepper, which in Africa, Ghost Peppers are used to deter elephants from crossing uh, bridges or, or oh fences. Like, like it, it, the elephant smells it and it goes the other way. And then in uh, Thailand, on boats, the Trinidad Scorpion, it is spread like on the boats to kill bacteria. So you actually low key got a cleanse yeah, tonight. Got a little cleanse, man, you know what I mean? Fuck that cleanse. I do that shit. <laughs> that shit was crazy. Man, but Johnny, man, we we really we really appreciate it. We definitely gonna come back, man. We can start talking about my golden ticket. Yeah, it up luck. Luck's on the hall in Hall of Fame, so why? What did he do to get there? He ate. He's been he's been rocking with us since day nah, one. He's day one, you know. And he's, sandbox. Sam, he's a sandbox too. Cause I remember he used to post it all the time, and like the way he would post it, I'm like, damn, I gotta go try that. Yeah. Bro. You know what's funny with Luck is that so many people come by to the restaurant, and Luck would tell them, "Hey, tell Johnny uh, Luck sent you." And so every time someone that Luck sent, they would say, hey, Luck sent me. And so many people showed up. And you were like, back in the line. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. But it's so funny because you don't realize word of mouth. That's yeah. another thing for, for a lot of restaurants and stuff yeah. is like, it, it's not all just social media. Word of mouth is a big thing. You know what I mean? You hook up a customer, they go tell their auntie or something like that. And it just spreads, you know? So. Well, we hope that we can uh, spread some more awareness to your amazing establishment. Yeah. This Fuck, was, this was man. dope. We hungry. Shout out fucking Hollywood. Shout out Johnny, man. This was crazy. Pull up to Pasadena, come get yours. If you want to get the Harlem Plus, that's on you. We're not recommending it, but if you, you're fucking weird or whatever the fuck's wrong with you. Yeah, you a serial killer. Come over here and eat. Eat these four yeah, nuggets. Jeffrey Dahmer would have loved this shit. You like that one? Eh, dark humor. All right, rap it. Shout out dark hey, humor. Hey, hey. Uh, bro, that one right the there. wings were hot. Oh my God. We're gonna meet fucking God. That, that will make you reevaluate everything. Uh, yeah, and I don't like this fucking guy's big ass smile over here. 